What are the best free Shopify apps? In this video, I'm gonna show you six free Shopify apps that you can install and use in your store right now. What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here and we don't know each other, my name's Kerry and I created this channel to bring you the best strategies, secrets, and hacks to grow your online t-shirt, apparel, print on demand business, and sometimes we also just talk about Shopify and e-commerce in general. And today I wanna to show you six of the top free apps in the Shopify app store. And these are kind of my personal top free apps. I do use a lot of paid apps and I recommend a lot of paid apps, but I wanted to give you some more options. I know there's a lot of people out there looking for apps that don't cost anything, but can be very powerful. And so in this video, I'm gonna show you six really, really great apps to use in your Shopify store that literally cost nothing. A couple things to know before we jump into the apps. Number one, I'm going to be focusing on apps that are completely free or have truly free plans. I've seen some other videos about free Shopify apps and most people are recommending these apps that don't have a lot of functionality um, and that have paid plans when you hit a certain limit or those kind of things. And I really wanted to give you a solid list of apps uh, that have completely free plans or are actually completely free. So that's number one. Number two, I'm not including any drop shipping apps or print on demand apps. I think it goes without saying that uh, print on demand and drop shipping apps for the most part are free monthly. Um, so I'm not gonna include those on this list. Although I think that's a great benefit of Shopify is that you can hook up to a print on demand company for free or a drop shipping uh, provider for free. So that is awesome, but I'm not going to include those apps on this list. Lastly, these are in no particular order. This isn't like six, five, four, three, two, one. These are just six of what I believe is the best free apps in the Shopify app store. The first app on this list is the product reviews app from Shopify. Now, Shopify actually makes this app very, very simple app, but essentially what it is, it's a review app. It's going to allow you to display customer reviews on the different products in your store. It's going to allow your customers to submit reviews in your store. And it also has some kind of cool features. Like it allows you to uh, publish and hide and filter them on the back end. And then you can also import or export your reviews from spreadsheets and those kind of things. So there is some management built into this app, but overall in the kind of grand scheme of review apps, it's a pretty basic app. There are more advanced apps like uh, Looks Reviews or my personal favorite, uh, Vitals, which does a, a lot of other things. But if you're looking for a free product reviews app, this is this is where to go. It's, it's great and it's completely free. There is no cost. Um, and it kind of goes without saying, but product reviews are a must have on your store. The majority of customers are considering those product reviews before they make a purchase. So it's absolutely necessary that you have a reviews app on your store. And this is a great option to do that. It's completely free. The next app on this list is the free shipping bar from uh, Hextum. Now this is like maybe my personal favorite app or at least one of my top apps. I've been using this app for a number of years. I've had it going back to my very first Shopify store. Essentially what the free shipping bar does is it allows you to set a threshold for free shipping. You've probably seen it on some of your favorite uh, brands and websites uh, where it says, you know, spend a certain amount like $50, spend $75 and earn free shipping. This allows you to put a bar on the top of your website that reflects that number. And what's cool about it is it automatically updates based on the amount that is in the cart. So if I add a $20 item to the cart and I get free shipping at $50, it will tell me that I only need to spend 30 more dollars to get that free shipping. Now, the reason I'm recommending this, what you might've noticed here is that there is a 9.99 per month plan. This free plan is all that you need in my opinion, and it, it doesn't ever cost anything. There's no limit on like the number of orders or anything like that. It's fully customizable with like your brand colors and everything. Um, and it allows you to, to create that bar up at the top. And I'll actually show you in the test store kind of what that looks like. You see up here, free shipping for all orders over $100. And if we add an item to the cart from this little test store, it should, uh, it should update that at the top there to kind of show you what that looks like. Let's go over to our cart and see if that will update. There we go. So it says only $80 away from free shipping. Now this is showing like a, a Halloween style theme. 
I think that's a little much. I usually just go with, with my kind of branding for my store, but it's a great, great way to incentivize your customers to spend more money to get upsells, even without having an upsell app. Uh, this is a really basic, but really powerful way to increase that average order value, which we know is so important. So this app, I've used the free version for probably four plus years. It's a great, great app. Highly recommend the free shipping bar. Next up on the list is the Facebook channel app. This is the official app for Facebook uh, for your Shopify store. So many reasons to have this app installed. I wanna talk about a few of those. Now this allows you to do a lot of different things on your store uh, in relation to Facebook. One of the things you can do is send all of your products over to a Facebook shop or on your Instagram to make your Instagram sh uh, shoppable. That can all be done from the Facebook channel app. You can also run ads from the Facebook channel app. You can install your Facebook pixel. Um, there's a ton of stuff you can do with this Facebook app and it helps Shopify and Facebook work together. Now, you can run ads, you can do all that kind of stuff without the Facebook channel app, but this app makes a lot of things that can be really difficult. It makes them a lot easier. Specifically, like when you're trying to get your uh, Facebook pixel installed, this makes it just a few clicks to get that pixel installed on your store. And I don't love it for running ads. You can run Facebook ads from, uh, from this app. I don't necessarily recommend that. What I do recommend on the ad side from the Facebook channel app is to run your retargeting ads through the Facebook channel app. If you don't know what retargeting is, uh, retargeting is basically when people come to your website, they view a product, you can then show them an ad uh, with that same product that they were viewing. You've probably seen this before on your Facebook feed. So you go to your favorite retailer's website, you're looking at a product, you're like, mm, should I buy this, should I not? You go back over to Facebook or Instagram and all of a sudden you get an ad from that company. That is called retargeting. Retargeting is very powerful and it's, a, it's, it's very cheap to run retargeting ads and actually get sales and make profits from retargeting. And the Facebook channel app is probably the best way to do that because it's extremely easy. If you try to run your retargeting ads through the Facebook ads manager, you can definitely do it that way. It just can be a real pain in the butt. And this makes dynamic product retargeting ads very, very easy. So I highly recommend the Facebook channel if you're wanting to set up your Facebook shop and make your Facebook page shoppable, make your Instagram account uh, shoppable where people are viewing your Instagram and they can see the products and get your pixel installed and uh, run your retargeting ads. I highly recommend the Facebook channel app for all those reasons. And like I said, there is more that you can do with this app, but those are the big ones that I would recommend. I would not recommend running your regular Facebook ads from this. Don't do that. You won't get very good results. Do that from your Facebook ads manager, but all the other stuff we've talked about, definitely recommend doing through this app. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, would you do me a quick favor? Just take one quick second, hit that like button. That's gonna tell YouTube that this video, that people like it, and they're gonna show it to more people. So the way that we get this content out to more people is by you just hitting that like button. Okay, next up is Upcart in cart upsell. Okay, this is a really, really good app. Now, I just recently kind of found this app. Let me explain. There is another app called in cart upsell. I have used that app. It's basically the same functionality as Upcart, but this one has come out and it seems to be more powerful for free. The other in-cart upsell app is great. It has a free plan, but it's very limited on what you can do. You can basically just add one upsell uh, that kind of shows on all your products and you have to pay uh, for a higher plan to do more upsells. This app is not like that. This app is completely free. You can see right here, there's no paid plans. It's completely free. And I don't know if I've explained exactly what it does, but basically when your customer adds an item to the cart, it will show an upsell that you create uh, on that cart page. And I'll show you on the example store uh, what it does here. So this is basically what it does. Now, if I remove this item from the cart and we go back, this is an example store again. So if I add, uh, this item to the cart. When I go to my cart, what it's gonna do, give it a second here, it'll pop up an upsell offer right here for another product. It'll give a discount code. It looks very clean. It's not 
I mean, it looks great. And I can simply just hit add to cart and it will add that item to the cart and give me that discount uh, at checkout. And so this is a really, really great app. And again, you can set up as many in-cart upsells as you want with this app and it's free. And you can set the discount percentage, you can set the, um, the, the, the wording of what you wanna say as far as that. But again, it kind of goes without saying that you need an upsell app. You need to be focused on increasing that average order value because that's gonna how you're gonna drive your profits up in your Shopify store. And that's how you can make your ads more profitable and so many other things. And this is a great free way to do it. I, I would highly recommend that you take a look at this Upcart in cart upsell app. Make sure you're using this one. I will give this disclaimer because you know sometimes these apps come out like this and they're free and maybe it's an initial kind of beta or testing type thing. So at the time of recording this, this is a completely free app. I have no idea if they'll charge in the future. It's just, I was kind of shocked to see that this app was completely free with the functionality that it has. So at the time of recording this, this is completely free. I definitely recommend that you go and take advantage of using this app and maybe sometime in the future it will cost, but as of right now, it is free. And I would definitely, definitely, definitely go jump on this app, Upcart, Incart, Upsell. Next up on this list is Cartloop SMS Marketing. Okay, this is a really, really cool app. This one out of out of all six apps that, I've, that I'm showing you, this one's probably the closest to being a paid app, but I'll explain how it works because it, it is still free. Um, the way that it kind of works is on a, a commission type basis. So I'll show you how that works, but this is a great app. I've been testing this for a while and it's really effective and really cool concept. What Cartloop SMS marketing is, is Basically, the, it's, it's most common functionality. There's other stuff that you can do with this and it's constantly evolving, but it's basic functionality is that for free, you can set up um, you can set up abandoned cart SMS messages. And what Cartloop does is they have some automated messages that will go out to your customer and try to recover the lost sales, okay? And they actually have a an, an actual support team of real people that will text with your customers and try to close the sale for you. So you can think of this as kind of your own SMS sales team, text sales team, that is working on your behalf trying to close sales. Now what's the catch here? The catch is this app is completely free and you only pay a commission of 10% if they can recover sales for you. So I absolutely love this, uh, this model especially for, as a, uh, you know, if you're a beginner out there and you don't have a lot of sales, you can install cart loop and you can let this sales team just do whatever they want to try to recover these sales for you. And you just pay them a small commission if they make you money. So you only pay if you make money. So I really love that. And you can see right here, this has unlimited carts recovered on the free version. So when you go up to the 49 a month version, um, you, you basically, the percentage commission that you're paying seven goes down to 7% from 10%. So this is free. Once you, if you were doing, you know, 20, 30,000, $40,000 a month, uh, in recovered sales. So, you know, that's, that's a big amount. You might want to consider upgrading, but this free plan is really, really powerful and there's no catch. I mean, it's going to be completely free. You can recover as many carts at the, that, you know, let them recover as many carts as possible and just pay them that small 10% uh, commission on the sales that they recover. This is really, really cool. It's very easy to set up. Essentially what you do is you install the app and they have you put a little bit of text in the checkout section of your website that asks for the customer's phone number. And you would be shocked what the high percentage of customers that give their phone number there as they're checking out uh, when you just make this small adjustment that they, they ask you to make. And again, this app is very, very powerful. If you've got a lot of abandoned carts or you're running a lot of traffic to your store, this is kind of a no brainer. Just install it and let, let the cart, cart loop team do the work and just pay that small commission. Last up on this list is the Instagram feed and shoppable, like Instagram hub, Insta feed hub is, is what it's called. Um, this is a cool app. There are a bunch of Instagram feed apps on the store, but this one specifically is free, completely free. Uh, there's no catch or anything. It's completely free. Now, again, small disclaimer, maybe it'll cost money in the future. I don't know. I don't know if this is a new app or what. You can see it doesn't have a lot of reviews, 
but it is a really, really cool app. Essentially, what this app allows you to do is put your Instagram feed on your Shopify store. And then you can also add like shoppable pins and that kind of thing um, here. And there's different styles you can see, like you can have it look like this, you can have it look like this up here. Uh, you see inside of the app right there, they kind of show you there's a lot of different options. This is a great way to pull your social media into your website. One of the reasons I love doing this on websites is because number one, it, it looks great just to have your feed there. But number two, it, 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 it kind of bridges the gap between your website and your social media. So the, the hope is that you'll get people clicking over to your Instagram account and following you there. And then having it be shoppable is cool because if they see a product in the feed that they want, they can click that, it'll take them right over to the page. And so it's a really, really um, cool app, very easy to set up. Uh, and I'd highly recommend it, it's completely free. So go get it, Instagram hub, Insta, Insta feed hub, Insta feed hub. All right, there you have it. That is my top six free Shopify apps. Go get them right now, go install them, start putting them to work for you because most of these apps, they make you more money. So that's great and they don't cost anything. And by the way, if you are trying to get your Shopify store set up, maybe right now you're watching this video because you're doing some research uh, on Shopify and some of the different apps and some of the different things you can do. I wanna give you a free 13 step Shopify cheat sheet. Uh, and you can go to shirtschool.com slash cheat sheet and you can get that completely free. Put in your email there and on the next page, you can just download that cheat sheet. What that's gonna do is it'll walk you through each step of getting your store built and set up um, so that you have something to kind of follow so you know when you're done, when you're ready and what things to be looking out for. Some really good information in there. And again, that's completely free. It'll just help you get your store built out a little quicker and a little easier. So again, just head over to shirtschool.com slash cheat sheet. You can download that 13 step cheat sheet completely free. I hope you have a great day and we will see you next week.